Okay, so we start with a, with a blank page. So we're going to just load in one of our pre prepared files as information about countries and their memberships. So certain European countries are members of the European Union and other Asian countries are members of ASEAN. So we can get rid of this now, seeing as the United Kingdom is no longer a member. But let's say we wanted to add in a new node. So we're going to pull Spain in. So this file gets loaded into its own layer and it gives us our Spain node. So we're going to move this into the Europe layer. And now let's just change the color of that Europe layer. Make it a little more appealing. So you can see all of the countries that were in that layer are now recolored. So let's add a relationship. So we know Spain is a member of the European Union. So now we've got this edge created that shows the relationship. So you can focus on any node that exists in this graph just by clicking on it within the table view. It'll refocus. Yeah. And we've got a search functionality as well. So you can search for things by their name, which is a SAN, or maybe you want all nodes that have a population, which shows us all the countries that we have loaded in. So you've made a few changes to this file and now you want to save what you've done. So you're going to output a new file. And let's say we make a silly change. We, we accidentally delete a bunch of our layers. And oops, a bunch of connections are gone. Well, we can load in our previous state and you can share it with others as well. And everything's back to the way it was, all the colors, all the positions. So you can also modify individual properties about these nodes. So for example, if I go into Vietnam here and change the population, the, the change will be reflected in the output file as well. Yeah, so now we just have to clean up our editor. So we're going to get rid of the Spain layer that was created when we pulled the file in. But let's say we didn't exactly want to do that. We've got undo and redo features that let you change any mod change anything you've modified here back to a previous state. And finally, you can create a new layer based off of nodes you've already got in the graph. So let's add this layer to the Asia layer. Let's just make it contain all of the Korean countries. South Korea and North Korea. So now you can see that their color has changed over here and they're part of their own sub folder within the, within the Asian countries.